So now says its pool will not open at all this season after being temporarily closed to repair a leak. Now Reagan Detrolio is live at the pool with a disappointment from would be pool goers. Reagan. Lee, the Nixa Parks Department says this pool is going to need a lot more repairs than first thought and Nixa parents are just ready for it to be open again. Usually we can just get up and go in the evening. I don't necessarily have to plan it. We don't really need a bunch of stuff. We're not going to be gone for a long time. You know, it's just a few minutes away, so we're really bummed. It's um, changed our summer plans a lot. Christine Satterley is a mom in Nixa who always goes to the Nixa pool with her kids and friends. She even had her five-year-old daughter's birthday party booked there. You can rent it out after hours and just have like a private party. And so we had planned that and we had sent out invitations early to her friends at school before school got out because she has an early June birthday. And then we had to scramble and find somewhere else to have the party because it was closed for sure in June and our party was the first week in June. And we had like a week to figure it out. Although Satterley did get a refund, she's still unsure why it's taken so long for Nixa Parks to officially announce this closure. And Nixa Parks director Matt Krause says it's been a crazy summer trying to fix the leak. We did make a repair to uh, the area that was identified as, as a leak. Uh, unfortunately, there's either, either that wasn't it or there's another one. He says everyone is upset about this news. It's just as heartbreaking and disappointing for staff here at the Parks Department in the city as it is for our community. To that's not getting to swim this summer. And Christine Satterley and her kids just can't wait to go back to their local pool again. We're really hopeful that since they found out now, they have all of the time until it's winter to fix it. So hopefully that'll be plenty of time for it to um, be ready for next year because we're ready for it to be open. Krause says all the money for swim lessons, season passes, and reservations that remain should get refunded by early next week at the latest. If you'd like to find out more on how to get a refund, just visit this story on our website.